Hi there. I am representing webtrackofficial.org. We provide all sorts of digital marketing solutions like web designing, social media integration, search engine optimization, graphic designing and logo designing. So if you want any services from us, contact us at support at webtrackofficial.org. In this video I am going to show you how you can add Google OneTap login to your WordPress website. I've previously recorded a video on it. If you haven't seen it yet, go here to do so. I was getting many comments that my previous video was not helping, so I decided to make a step-by-step -step video for you guys. Alright, in this video, I'll walk you through the process step-by-step -step so you can add OneTap Google sign into your website. So make sure to watch this video till end to avoid any errors, and subscribe to my channel. Now let's get to it. Let's begin with installing the plugin, so go to the add new option under plugins. Now search for Google One Tap. Install this plugin with 500 plus installations. Once it's activated, a new menu item will be visible to you on the left sidebar. Click Google One Tap. This brings us to step 2, where you must enter your Google Client ID. You must go to the Google Developers Console and create a new project before you can obtain the Client ID. Name your project here, then select Create. Your project has been created successfully. Simply select a project from the pop-up menu in the top right to activate it. From the left sidebar, under API and Services, click off Consent screen. Here you need to choose External to configure and register your app. Click Create. Now name your app, and select the registered email address as user support email. Under app domain, paste the URL for your website's homepage. Under authorized domains, paste the same URL. If you face errors, just remove the protocols or any additional backslash from your URL. Under Developer Contact Info, enter email address again and click Save and Continue. Skip this step. Also exclude this. Review your settings and click back to Dashboard. Important step. You must publish it from here in order for Google One Tap to function. It's time to generate credentials. Click Credentials from left menu. Click Create Credentials from top, and select Auth Client ID. Select Web Application as Application Type. Just add Authorized JavaScript Origin, and redirect URL, and click Create. Once you click Create, it will generate your credentials for your project. For now we just need the client ID, so let's just copy that. And back to the dashboard. And paste here. Check this if you want it on login screen of WordPress as well. Just save your changes and we're done. Alright, now let's check. I am gonna log out of my dashboard to check.
and here you can see, it's working fine. And if I check my website from front end, here you can see, it's working perfectly fine. Let me show you in another browser as well. See, it's working fine. So if this video helped you in any way, like this video and subscribe to my channel, see you later, alligator.